athletes, here are the best and worst sports drinks. I'm going to walk you through exactly what is good and what is bad. Okay, is this really a hydrating drink? Well, let's look at what you lose when you sweat. When you sweat, you lose sodium, potassium, and magnesium mainly. In human sweat, you lose sodium to potassium at a 3.5 milligram to 1 milligram ratio. In prime, we just don't have enough salt. We're talking 0 0.014 milligrams of sodium to 1 milligram of potassium. That is way too much potassium to sodium. So this is garbage. Get this out of here. Ah, the traditional red 40 Gatorade. I see so many people drinking this and it's garbage. I'll tell you why. This has way too much sugar. You're talking 34 grams of sugar and it's from processed sugar. You add in artificial food dyes like red 40 and caramel color. This is just a horrible drink. Okay, Gatorade Fit. Well, I would love to hate on this because it is still made by the Pepsi Corporation. I can't hate on it that much from an ingredient standpoint. We have water. We have watermelon juice. We don't have any processed sugar. We don't have any artificial food dyes. And there is sea salt in here, which I like, but it's not perfect. It's completely missing magnesium. There's no magnesium in here whatsoever. I don't know how you sell a sports drink without magnesium. Red Bull is probably one of the dumbest things you can drink, especially if you drink this in the afternoon 